Hi YouTube, this your girl, I want that hair. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Today is Super Bowl Sunday. The game is on right now, but I know this by the time I get this video up, I'm pretty sure it'll probably be a few days down the line. Cause I got some other videos that I need to upload. That I haven't uploaded yet, but Super Bowl Sunday. And uh, but hopefully I'll get this video up before the end of the week. And hopefully you guys watch it at the end of the week or before. Anyway, I want to show you guys this wig that I purchased on yesterday um, at one of our, my local beauty supplies. Um, this is a, it was on sale for, I got it for uh, 15, it was on sale 50% off. The lady at first had told me it was $29.99 and 50% off of that. So it came out to $14.99 and then plus tax on top of that. And then when I get to the counter, the guy was like, oh, no, it was $34.99 and then 50% off. And I was like, no, that ain't what the lady told me. So we went back and forth like several times, back and forth. I'm like, well, she said $29. I said, I really didn't want the wig. I was just, you know, coming in here looking for something else. I said, I just bought it because of, she said it was $14.99 or $15, $15 or whatever, 50% off. That's the only reason why. Even though it was, you know, a few bucks, but he tried to charge me $34.00. And then 50% off of that, which would have been about, what, $18 or so, but still, you know, once you tell me something the first time, you know, you, you know, stick to it, you know what I'm saying? I don't care what she said or you said or whatever, but if you hold me the first price and I'm, I'm set on that, that's what you're going to give me. So anyway, I was like, okay, well, forget it, then I don't want it. So, you know, I really didn't want the wig. I just saw the reason why I'm buying it. So he was like, well, fine, I'll give you the discount that you got, you know, even though it's supposed to be this price. I'm like, okay, got it. Thank you. So anyway, <laughs> anyway, so the name of this wig is by the company called Beauty and You. Right here, it's called Beauty and You, made in Indonesia. Um, it says Beauty and You, item EH133. Uh, the style is called Good Girl. And the color is a four. See that right there. So, And it is... Yeah, it is definitely, got, this has to be a, I'm assuming this is a synthetic wig, you know, it doesn't say on here, it just says it's made in the need of the room. And the washing instructions, fill a basin with cool or lukewarm water, add a dash of mild shampoo, which gently, when starting with cold water, lay hair flat, or let it drip dry, please. Do not brush your comb while wet, no scent necessary curls, or snap back into the room. And dry so I'm pretty sure this is a synthetic I don't know it is it is a synthetic wig um think about like about it here it has like a zigzag kind of thing going right here I don't know if you can see that see how the, the split is right here it kind of goes zigzag like that short bang in the front um kind of wavy like a loose kind of wave there let you see the back. That's the back. Let's do it all back. See that? And so I thought it was cute, you know. Thought it was cute, a little different, you know. Got a bang and everything, so I like it. Happy with it. Got a good price for only um fifteen dollars plus tax. So nice little. And it's a really nice soft hair. It's really soft. I really like it. So this morning, I just sprayed a little of this on it this morning. And uh, to kind of get a little shine to it. And then later on, before I made the video, I said, let me try the little the wig shine. So I sprayed a little, just sprayed a little bit of that on it just now. I guess to kind of keep it kind of tame. You know, and I like how it lays flat on the top. Top like so. And, um... Thing about it, it doesn't have any combs. It does have the um, adjustable straps and hooks in the back there, which is cool. A little short little fringe bang right there. The bang kind of kind of goes down right there on the sides. So I think it's I think it can be versatile. You can kind of pull this back some if you like. You know, wear it back like that a little bit and that might give it a little change of the style like that you know probably can 
you know, I think it's versatile. I have one side, you know, pin it up like that, or probably, you know, both sides. Kind of go into the back if you like, and just have it like that. It's kind of cute, huh? Or I don't have my bobby pins in it right now, but normally I put bobby pins in it. Or, you know, sometimes, you know how I like to do a lot of my wigs is kind of have it off centered. You know, maybe having one side kind of going like that a little bit. You can be one side going like this and maybe make the one side go back a little bit and comb it. Let's see. I might have did it too much, huh? Didn't look too bad, huh? that as well so I think this wig will kind of last and it was the last one they had it was on a mannequin head so I think that's why it's kind of flat right here it fits perfect to my head so we're kind of going like that you know that's the way you can wear it so I like it so this is a color four Called style is called Good Girl. Company's called Beauty in You. The item number is E, like Edward H133. Beauty in You is the company. It said it was made in Indonesia. So I don't know. I know this ain't no Indonesian hair. Maybe something if it really <laughs> but no, it feels really soft. I really like it. So that and you know what I like to do is um just to hold it down securely, you know, put the little, the big bobby pins in it, like right, right in there, like that, so it won't, you know, be sliding back, you know, the other one, and on the other side, where is it at? Little in there, underneath, in there, and so make sure it's flat. Sometimes I put it in, then it's be sticking all out and stuff. So, so that ain't, yeah, I think it's a cute wig. So I'm gonna probably rock this for the week, all oh, this week, right here, and uh, as well. So hope you guys like it. I don't know. I haven't checked to see if it's online or nothing like that. You know. I haven't checked online to see if it is available. It might be, you know. You can check and see. To come, like I said, the company's called Beauty and You, and this style is called Good Girl. This is just a, a number four. So, and I got it from my local beauty supply. Well, I don't know if you guys are wondering, but I am rock, rocking my purple thread earrings there. You know, I think I got these off of um, eBay. eBay, like I think for a dollar, free shipping. A while back, I might have did a video on this on last year, so I thought it'd kind of go with my little, my little top here with a little parsley, you know. And it's Super Bowl today, you know. I ain't got no green, and I ain't got no black. Well, I'm black, no. <laughs> and also, normally I haven't been wearing like no neutral eyeshadow. I don't know. You probably can't really see it though, but y'all you know, probably don't care. Oh, you might, huh? No. <laughs> But I'm using um, Avon. Hey, this little Avon palette here called Eight in One Eyeshadow Palette, uh, Neutral Tone. So this lady at my job that sells Avon, and she be trying to hit us up, boy. So but the colors I use for today was this one was on my lids, look kind of light, and then this one here, kind of right there, and kind of blend it over. And then I use my little liquid MAC underneath my eyebrow there. So it's a nice little everyday neutral look. But lately I've been wearing like the smoky eye look lately. So kind of like how it turned out. You know, nicely everyday look. So okay, you guys, that's it. Don't need, need, don't need me prolonging the time. You know, can't wait till the halftime come on. I'm gonna see. I always enjoy that. So that's what I mainly like to see is the halftime. You know, I haven't watched a football game all year. I'm more of a basketball fan, you know. 